Hi, look what I have here. ESP32 board that runs this fun 15 puzzle game. I had uh, one of those when I was young and point of this game is to line these numbers in order. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 from 1 to 15. If I want to move uh, a number I just need to touch it. And if there is free space nearby number will move in that direction. I don't use uh, boards with touch screen very often but this board was perfect for for this project. It is made by uh, Maker Fabs company. It have a big resolution 320 by 480 pixels. It have touch screen and it is powered by newer version of ESP32 which is S2 version. And there is also one one more cool feature. The screen is connected to ESP32 chip using a parallel connection. So most of pins on ESP32 are used for display. This way uh, this display is much faster than a display that uses serial communication. Uh, this is not great. This is not great example for uh, to show the speed of this board, but but you can find some tests on YouTube and this displays really fast, which is great for games or for streaming video or something similar. Uh, there is also slot for SD card and some additional slots for uh, additional modules. Link is in the description so feel free to check this board on the Maker Fabs site. Uh, the game is quite quite addictive. At first I was unable to solve uh, this game but then I find couple tutorials on YouTube and now it, it is much easier. When a number is at its place it have this additional white dot here. Uh, I added the uh, time and moves variables so I can uh, compete with myself. I always try to solve it fast as I can with fewer moves. When game is created, I will go to new game, uh, all the all numbers are placed randomly. There was a problem because uh, whole, half of generated uh, combinations were unsolved. So I implemented a function that will find out if the combination of number is possible to solve. If combination is unsolved, new combination will be generated. Here I uh, add this scrolling te te text just to add some movement on screen. Here is new game, some additional text and it is this is practically it. I will share code on my github page link will be in description of this video so feel free to check it. Uh, keep in mind that this board don't use TFT SPI library it uses Lovian library which is practically the same. On uh, MakerFab site you can find detailed instruction how to install this board and uh, all the libraries in Arduino IDE. Process is easy and fast. Okay, finally let's play the game. I will choose new game 
and let's see one is here two is here uh, I need number three we have three four five uh, where is six six seven eight uh, Eight, and here it is. I managed to solve it in eighty one seconds and in, in one hundred and sixty six moves, and I'm quite happy with results. That's it. Overall, very interesting board. Big resolution, speed, and touchscreen in the same package. He, here is size comparison. Here is close to Arduino Uno. Very interesting board. I already have few ideas what can be done with this thank you for your time like always subscribe leave comment leave a like and have a nice day if you want to support my work link is in description so you can buy me a coffee thank you i will see you next week goodbye